so, our friends all gathered together inside Pooh's house. Their plan was to do something interesting and exciting, something totally new, something... Uh, um... <clears throat> hello? Oh, oh, oh. Uh, hello, Mr. Narrator. Oh, hello, everyone. <laughs> I'm afraid we're having a bit of trouble thinking of something to do today. Well, we I do certainly like are. I trust oh, George. Good Not in here. Mildly. Hmm, I see. That's too bad. But if you don't do anything, there's no story. Uh, we're doing that's true. Well, we must do something. Uh, Pooh, uh, everyone. Oh, did it hear? Oh, what oh, is it? Yes. What can I yes. do for you? Well, I um just thought of something. Just a small thought, really. Um, would anyone like to hear a poem that I wrote? A poem. What a wonderful idea. Oh, yes. That would be wonderful, Piglet. A poem seems just the thing for a day like today. <laughs> but, um, one question. What is a poem exactly? Well, it's kind of like a little story that uh, rhymes, I think. <gasps> That's a poem? Them rhymey singers that talk about moon and June and spoon and... Ooh, well, you know, it's funny, I'd, I'd really like to stay Piglet, but I gotta go and count my stripes. <laughs> you can count your stripes later, Tigger. No. Sit and enjoy Piglet's poem. Yeah, right. Or else. <coughs> <coughs> oh, my. That was a wonderful poem, Piglet. <gasps> But I, I haven't read it yet. Can I read it? Oh, Piglet, you mean there's more? Oh, certainly. I, I call this Ode to a Piglet. And so, as Piglet began to read his poem, he and all his friends began to imagine along with him. Perhaps we should as well. A Piglet is a very small thing. They laugh and dance and often sing. Figaro, Figaro, Figaro! <coughs> Oops, I got something in my throat. Piglets are cheery, pink and true. And our best friend is Winnie the Pooh. What's that? Tigger. <laughs> I was just resting my eyes. <laughs> is it over yet? No. Well, this isn't a very poetical piece of poetry, if you ask me, or if you don't. But it rhymes. And I have more. Excuse me. But, 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 piglets are very nice. They're even kind to little mice. Yeesh. Don't worry, little guy. It just needs a little fixing up. <laughs> but, Tigger, you can't write. Never stopped him before. Oh, there. Don't worry, Piglet. Tigger's just helping. Th th that's what I'm afraid of. It is done. <laughs> now, just sit back, close your eyes, sockets, and imagine with me whilst I read some real poetry. <laughs> Ahem, ahem, and etc. Piglet's love to take a stroll over hill and dale and grassy knoll. That's not so bad. Unfortunately, they don't always look where they go, and they fall right down that big old hole. Whoa. Ah. But don't you worry, he'll be back, because in that hole, there was a tack. <laughs> Ta-da! Don't you just love how back and tack rhyme? <laughs> now this is poetry. Tigger's making it all different. He certainly is, and I think it's a shame what he's doing to it. I'll help iambic your pentameter, my little friend. Uh, but, but, Rabbit, I, I have a very nice ending that I think you'll like. If you just let me read it. Oh, hush, Piglet. I'm showing Tigger how to really write a poem. We'll get to whatever you want to do later. Now then, <clears throat> imagine with me, if you will. Oh, my. A piglet is like a drop of morning dew, except when he gets a <clears throat> sneezing flu. <coughs> oh, dear. Now my poem is maybe all stuffy. 
A rose is a rose is a rose. Huh? Is red. Oh, well, that's nice. And so's a brick that falls on Piglet's head. Now, oh. that's a rhyme. <laughs> that rhyme is going to hurt. I'll help you, Piglet. Cinderella, a cappella, Isabella's new umbrella. <laughs> That wasn't a poem. But it rhymed. B but it didn't say anything. But it did save my friend Piglet from a brick. Thank you, Pooh. I thought it was very nice. You're welcome, Piglet. He's got you there, bunny boy. <laughs> well, let me have that. I'll show you poetry. Oh, yeah? Well, I'll show you poetry in a half. I'll show you poetry in three quarters. I'll show you more poetry than you can stick a shake at. Stop! <laughs> that, that, that's it. I'm taking my pigletry, and I'm leaving. Really? really? Oh, don't go, Piglet. But everyone's messing up my poem. Well, Piglet, one of the best things about poems is that they can help you say how you feel in here. And no one can ever take that away from you. Really, Pooh? But, but how? I, if everyone... Oh, why don't you just try again, Piglet? Let's hear the rest. And this time, really let us hear your inner... Um... Piglety stuffing. Okay, Pooh. Uh, here goes. <coughs> An old to a piglet. I'm not tall or as roundish as Pooh. There's a lot that a piglet can't do. If it's bouncing you want, well, perhaps you should go find a tigger. I'm the only one, you know. We know. And I'm not quite what you would call wise. Kind of shy, kind of smallish in size. And to help move a boulder, you'll want someone older and bigger. But if by chance you feel like singing, I could help you sing a song And if you really want to bounce I'll do my best to bounce along And I'm not really brave, it's true But when I'm with a friend like Pooh I feel I could fly Though not too far what does that really say? What piglets are? Piglets like a nice warm summer breeze And the sound of the leaves in the trees Or just having a talk As they're taking a walk with a friend and if you have a little problem, I could try to lend a hand. And if you're feeling sad, just tell me, and I'll try to understand. And a piglet's not brave, it's true, but if he has friends like you, he might write a poem or wish on a star and so you see I'm proud to be what piglets are oh, I got a lip quiver <laughs> there was really something there little buddy oh, Digger? Rabbit? Eeyore? What's wrong? Uh, didn't you like my poem? No, Piglet. We didn't like it. We didn't like it. You didn't? We, we loved it. it. Huh? Oh, that was, that was beautiful. Such emotion. It moved me. Didn't think it was possible. That was the most piglitical thing I ever heard, little buddy. <laughs> it just makes me want to colorify up my tail and go get in some flop. <laughs> Oink. Really? <laughs> it looks like you've made a few poetry lovers after all, Piglet. Yeah. <laughs>